All right. Hey, everyone. Welcome back. We're diving into some really interesting stuff today. Drill rap. Okay. I think it's a fascinating genre. Lots to unpack here. Genre. We've got this article. Yeah. Drill rap's paradox, a path to fame or a road to ruin. Hmm. Catchy title. Right. Yeah. And it really kind of perfectly sums up what we're going to be looking at. Okay. So what do we think? Like the authenticity of it all. Yeah, like how real does it have to be? Right. And what happens when that realness goes I, too far? It's like drill is all about that gritty, raw yeah. view of street life, right? Yeah. Like um, that's the draw. Totally, like you're right there in the thick of it. Exactly. And I think that's why people love it. You know, it feels- It feels real, yeah. Real, yeah. And like, have you ever like listened to an artist and you're just like, Oh yeah, totally. Like, this is this is the real deal. Totally, like you feel like you're getting a glimpse into a world mm -hmm. that you wouldn't normally see. A hundred percent. And there's something compelling about that, right? Like that. Oh, for sure. Your authenticity. But see, there's the flip side. You get that realness, mm -hmm. and it's like yeah. it can kind of. It can be dangerous. Dangerous, yeah. It can really backfire. The article actually mentions Lil Durk, oh, and his arrest Why? on charges that include murder for hire. That's intense. Yeah, it gets really serious really fast. Yeah, it makes and, you think, uh, right. where's the line? Where's the line, exactly. Like, is it all just part of the act? Yeah, yeah and that's what I think is so interesting about this whole thing is, like, mm -hmm. the fans are so drawn to that realness. They're, mm -hmm. like, living vicariously through. It's almost like a reality show, you know? Yes, that's exactly what the article said. Like, it's a yeah. reality show, and they're hooked. Hooked, totally. But then, when it goes too far, when that realness has these really serious consequences, uh -huh. Suddenly, they're like, oh, you were... You messed up. You messed up. You were foolish. Yeah. It's like, they want the drama, but they don't want the actual... Consequences. Consequences, yeah. So are these artists, are they almost like... It's like they're stuck. Yeah, like stuck. In this live action drama yeah. where they can't break character, you know. They're playing a role. Yeah. Think about Lil Durk again. Or Quando Rondo. Mm -hmm. Young Boy Never Broke. Again... These guys, mm -hmm. everything they do, it's fuel for the fire, you know? Yeah. Every post, every diss track. Which, a diss track, just to clarify, that's when they... Oh, right, yeah. That's like, it's a song. Calling someone out? Yeah, directly at another artist, like an insult. <laughs> like, the drama you... just keeps escalating. It's like they have to keep upping the ante, you know? Yeah, so like, how much are they sacrificing to keep up this image? It's a huge sacrifice. And I think yeah. the article makes a really good point when it says drill rap. Mm -hmm. It's supposed to be the voice of the streets, right? Yeah, yeah. But it can actually become a dead end. A dead end, yeah. For these artists. It's like they get trapped. Trapped, yeah. yeah. And the industry, they're profiting off of it. Right, and it's almost like the mm -hmm. fans who are so obsessed with this, like... That street life narrative. Yeah, the authenticity. Mm -hmm. They don't fully grasp. They see the surface, but not what's underneath. Yeah. Like, uh, the human cost, the toll it takes. It's like a... It's a tightrope walk, you know? Yeah, the balancing act. Balancing act, yeah. Yeah. How do you stay real hmm. while also staying safe? And meeting your fans' expectations. Exactly. How do you do all that? It's a tough question, yeah. It's a huge question. And I don't know if there's an easy answer. It's a paradox. It really is. But it makes you think yeah. about where the responsibility lies. Hmm. You know, like on the artist side and on the fan side. Totally. Because when we demand that realness yeah. and art imitates life, mm -hmm. What happens when things go wrong? Yeah, where does the blame fall? Who's accountable? That's the question, isn't it? I think so. And I think it's a question worth asking about a lot of genres. Yeah. But with drill, it's just so... In your face. Yeah, in your face. It's really out there. It makes you think. It does, it makes you think. So what are we taking away from this? I think, for me, it's just being more aware, you know? Like, mm -hmm. when we're consuming music, any kind of art really thinking about the the bigger picture the bigger picture yeah and where it comes from a role in it too yeah like how are we contributing to the problem maybe right because sometimes we're part of the equation yeah definitely so much to think about <laughs> always is <laughs> well thanks for diving deep with us today everyone yeah this is a good one yeah definitely a lot to unpack here always more to explore always more to explore that's for <laughs> sure <laughs> until next time see you next time